Are you looking to renovate your home and want to know the top ways that you can increase your appreciation super fast? Then this video is for you. After watching this video, you're going to learn about the best ways to renovate your home for the best return on your investment. And it's all going to begin right after this. Hi everyone, Josh Tavares, investor and realtor at the XP Realty covering the greater Toronto area. It would mean so much if you can help us out and hit the like button hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell to get updates on our newly uploaded content. And if you're thinking of getting into real estate investing, click the link below. We have access to off-market US investment opportunities that we're looking to partner with people just like you. And if you wanna learn more, remember to hit that link. And without further ado, let's begin. As you know, with investing in real estate, there's many ways that you can win, such as cash flow, appreciation, and mortgage pay down. And today we're gonna to be talking more about the force appreciation, which is another element within another way to win with investing in real estate. And we're talking about fantastic renovation tips that you've got to get your hands on to increase not only the value of your own personal residence, but also your rental portfolio. Now, arguably the most important area that you wanna spend your time and money with investing into your rental property for renovations is your kitchen. As you well know, that kitchen is one of the areas we spend the most time in our home. And it's fantastic for areas if you wanna attract high-end tenants, buyers, as well as investors to invest into your properties. And with a modern spin with your kitchens, you wanna have light colors with light cabinetry, as well as light colored countertops. This color approach is gonna be fantastic at attracting high-end tenants, investors, as well as buyers. And it's gonna look fantastic, especially with a Hertz countertop. Some improvements that you can make towards your kitchen to make a big difference are new appliances, countertops, sink, taps and cabinetry that can cost you within the range of $8,000 to $10,000. Now when it comes to flipping, it's going to be on a higher range from twelve dollars to $15,000. You want to get high-end materials with a high-end finish because you're looking to sell it to a high-end clientele who's going to love this kitchen. With spending an average about $10,000, you're looking to about appreciation within twenty dollars to $30,000 easy. Now if you're on a bit of a tight budget, one thing that I can recommend is investing into new flooring and baseboards that pop and within maybe a lighter color and have it spread out evenly throughout the home. By doing this, this will make the home look larger and have a consistent theme and be easier when obtaining materials. Now, the second most important area to spend your budget when remodeling home is your bathroom. One thing I really recommend if you're gonna go in and spend a little bit more is to get double sinks, especially his and her sinks that are really in demand right now. Buyers and renters love having dual sinks so both parties can use it at the same time without having to wait for the other person. Once again, you wanna have a light color that stands out, makes the bathroom look larger. And ideally what I'd like to use is hexagon tiles on the floor with black grout. Some great things that I recommend within your bathroom remodeling is nice white subway tiles, as well as some Ikea floating vanities. These are really trendy and look fantastic. As an investor, whether you're doing buy and hold, flips, rent home, whatever your strategy is, you can go about having the same type of look and feel throughout the house for all your properties. This way, it makes life so much easier for contractors, yourself when purchasing materials, and tenants and buyers love the way it looks. The higher in the finish, the better the tenants, the better the buyers, and more value you will get on offer night. And just like the continued theme I mentioned throughout the video, you wanna have lighter flooring so it matches well with the lighter feel so it makes the home seem larger instead of smaller with a darker color. Now, for investors who are looking to have long-term tenants, this is a great strategy by remodeling, investing into the home, having it look fantastic so we can have less turnover and have more fantastic tenants stay in our properties. Having a light gray crushed vinyl flooring is gonna be fantastic for your home. It's gonna make it look brighter and look super modern. This particular flooring is very durable and very good for wear and tear, especially if you're gonna have tenants stay for the long term or even if you're gonna go about flipping a property. I recommend spending a little bit more materials if you personally can within your budget because the cost of labor of contractors is going up. However, it'll stay the same whether it's hardwood flooring versus vinyl. So it's something to keep your mind into, especially if you're going about flipping and especially your own rentals. Now, another space that you can renovate in your home is actually have a feature wall. Having a feature wall that's light blue is gonna look fantastic and stand out amongst everything else in the market, which is gonna be great for having tenants as well as investors or buyers 
looking to purchase your property. With the market changing now a little bit more towards the buyer side as it was before, we want to be able to stand out from the pack and have some sort of an edge that's going to beat us out versus a competition. And the last thing I want to touch upon is curb appeal. Now, most of the funds are going to be invested on the inside, as we mentioned, for the bathroom as well as the kitchen. But you want to have some funds invested so you can enhance the curb appeal of the outside of the home. Now, I recommend that you cut the grass, trim the hedges, get some flowers, and even add some stone walkway that has more appeal for buyers as well as investors and tenants. It's going to look fantastic, look beautiful, and show more care, and have your property stand out from the competition. Essentially, we want to blow everyone's mind that we're looking to target, whether it's tenants, investors, or buyers. We want to be able to blow their mind, have a beautiful home that they want to put an offer, and we get the best ROI, whether it's trying to get top-notch tenants for rent, or trying to flip the property and make the most money in the shortest amount of time. There you have it, all the information that you need to begin your home remodeling process, whether you're an investor or you're looking to purchase as a buyer. Now, thanks so much for watching everyone. It was super helpful and insightful. If you can help out and hit the like button, hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell to get updates on our newly uploaded content. And as I mentioned earlier, if you're looking to invest in real estate, Click the link below. We have off-market U.S. rental properties that we are looking to partner with individuals just like you with high ROI, super turnkey. And if you guys want to know more about real estate investing, click the card above. I go super in-depth into the topic. Thanks so much for watching. See you next time.